What's going on guys? This is Kevin the Tech Ninja and I'm a guy that loves technology and I have the opportunity to review a lot of stuff. Now very rarely I run into something that changes the way I look at something. And I gotta be honest, this is the first time that I can remember in a very long time that this has happened. What I'm talking about today changed the way that I watch TV and play video games. Tech that you're gonna break the mold, ran state control, scopes broad and the case is closed. Real talk with a hell of a red, every word is unfiltered, you want dread. This is the dream screen, and what this does, it converts your TV into something more. It's a series of LEDs that plugs into an HDMI dongle. This dongle then communicates to the source and tells the LEDs what to do. The HDMI dongle takes your source on one side, then on the other side we have the LED controller and the last port is used for your TV. I actually hooked mine up to my amp, so it works for all my inputs, so no matter what I switch to, it shows up. Installation didn't take too long at all, I just stuck the LEDs, and you start from the bottom right, and then you start going clockwise. There are three different sizes you can buy depending on the size of your TV. It supports TVs from 32 inches up to 80 inches. It's a bunch of smarty pants scientific stuff that goes on behind it, and I don't really care how it works. I just know it does. And the reason I said it changes everything, well, it fully immersed me into my screen and it breathed new life into my six-year-old TV. The LEDs are super accurate and the spread on the wall is very nice. What's pretty cool is that it's not overdone. It's just the perfect amount of light. The Dream Screen also has an application that you can go in and modify the settings on. The app works for Android and iOS, and you can download it right now if you want. The app lets you change the mode and also brightness of each mode. Right now, I have it on video mode, where the image spills off the screens onto the wall. But there's also music mode too, where it flashes on beat of the music. Then there's that classic ambient mode, and this lets you pick the color of the LEDs in sort of a static mode. And this amp, you can also turn off and on zones, so if you don't want it shining on a certain area, well, you can do that just by tapping on the arrow. The app opens up a few more options like color tuning, Bluetooth settings, and size settings. The app makes a great companion because my dream screen is actually in my wall. Well, if you don't want to use the app, you can just use the controller and make just about the same adjustments. This works great for games, movies, and sports. It brought a new level of enjoyment just watching a movie with the lights off or even gaming. You sort of just lose yourself in the LEDs and what you're watching on TV becomes one with the environment. This is on Kickstarter right now and is blasted through the goal already for obvious reasons. You still have time to pick one up for a discounted rate before it hits mass production. Once it does, the price will go up to the normal rate as suggested. I'm sure people will say, this is just like that one TV that came out of Europe a few years ago. Well, this converts any TV to have that same functionality of that overpriced TV that came out in Europe that's no longer being made. And there's the big difference. I mean, you can take this off and put this on another TV if you want. It's really nice and it's sort of modular in design too because the HDMI splitter is by itself and the LEDs are by itself. Just think about that for a second. All right guys, that's everything you need to know about the Dream Screen TV. Do me a favor guys, hit that thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below how you watch your Dream Screen TV. Let's get excited about it because I'm trying really hard to get a couple more to give to you guys. So Dream Screen, if you're watching this, let's do a giveaway, make it happen and uh, we'll go from there. Um, as always guys, my name is Kevin the Tech Ninja. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, leave a thumbs up, leave that comment, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.